Hey everyone, it's Ryzen. Welcome back to Let's Play uh, Grandia. Well, let's keep on trucking along, shall we? Alright, it should turn up a little bit here. There's gonna be uh, a thing here. Um, yeah, anyway, there's this enemy here called... Okay, well, we'll fight these guys because I'm gonna use uh, Dragon Cut. But uh, there's an enemy here called the Chameleon. Now, see, this if I wasn't using Dragon Cut here, I would use, uh, whatchamacallit, I'd use Burn Flare because they're in a bad formation. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, he's using, okay, good. He's using Sonar. I think that's their only move. Granted, I have a Swallowtail hat on Justin, so I'll be okay. But that's basically the one way I could die in this game. What a cinch. With confusion. Although I wouldn't likely game over, but I might be left with one character. Not bad. What was I saying? I got distracted there and I totally forgot. Oh, here we got a mixed battle. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I guess it wasn't important. Whatever, I totally forgot. Oh well. Sometimes it happens. Get Burn Flame going. There we go. Want to get one more fire level before we're out of here. Uh, I think I'm going to attack manually. Ah, damn it. They're going to poison me now. Oh, it also cancels you, huh? Forgot about that. Not bad, eh? But yeah, we'll be able to go through this too faster. At least the way I'm playing. I kind of set myself up to get strong enough to where I can blast through the game with minimal grinding. I mean, if you play your cards right, you really don't have to grind much in this game. Burn flame these guys. This is a good formation. Now, I don't recommend you use the defend command. Because Fina will waste a lot of her turn. She'll just kind of sit there for a while. So, I highly recommend that instead of using the defend command, use the evade command to pass turns. Don't be afraid to skip Fina's turn at this point, because she's basically done. I mean, all of Disc 1 was essentially used to finish off her development. Oh no, please hit the other guy. Oh, thank god. I didn't see that until after I had atta entered my attack command. I'm surrounded by cats. Not bad. I'd like to get another dragon cut off if I could. Alright, there's one item. I'm just gonna use that right away. Oh, crap. That's useless. I don't think I'm ever gonna use that, but I'll hold on to it. Oh, Torts Whistle. It, uh, yeah, it removes sleep from the party, so it could be useful, but. Eh. I guess I'm gonna drop the Thor's Fury. I really don't have a lot of. I definitely don't need a first aid anymore. That's a bit silly. 
I have Halval, but I want to keep one Panacea just in case something happens. I don't know. Fina could get silenced or something, or whatever the equivalent is. Uh, magic block? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. Hug over here, because there's another item over here. Somewhere. Am I wrong? Huh. There's supposed to be an item somewhere. That was a health lead, right? That's number 11? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was correct. Okay. God, I, I really hate this place. It's not hard or anything. Okay, there it is. I'm going to kill all these guys and be right back. All right, keep going. I really shouldn't have, like, any issues reaching leveling goals now. Oh, uh, that's not correct. I need to actually go down further. I'm going to go to the east here. Now, there's going to be a bunch of chests on these. Well, for one, just jump across. I'm not controlling this, by the way. Some money there. I think that was... Yeah. There's a little bit more money down here as well. Okay, good. Dragon cut. In a good situation here. Yep. Gonna dragon cut these guys. Oh, crap. Um, they're both using sonar. I have confusion resist. I'm gonna play it risky. I... I think I shouldn't get confused. Yes. If I didn't have the swallowtail hat, I would not have done that. Oh, come on, game. Really? I need to all heal. I don't really want to all heal her, but I have no choice. Unfortunately, I got some IP damage there. A lot of IP damage. Justin is never going to get a turn. <sighs> Freaking game. Dragon cut. The whole reason why I was showing this battle is because it wasn't going to take very long. Try not to get ambushed by the butterflies. It doesn't end well. There we go. And I leveled up my mace. I think it's time to switch to the axe. Look at that. 20 fire, 20 earth. And that wasn't even quite as good as the uh, moths alone. They give 24 for four of them, but eh, whatever. Should be some money somewhere. Uh oh. There, I keep going. Should be some money somewhere. Ah, oh, there it is. Now just keep going straight south. Should be a dungeon scope. And keep going south of that. To nab whatever the hell this thing is. I think it's a water charm. That I'll never use because... Um, what is the point of giving you a water charm when there is no offensive water magic or water skill in the entire game? It is the most useless charm in the game. I guess maybe it'll help you against freeze attacks a little bit, but at that point, why not just use a freeze charm that would be more effective against it? Eh, whatever. Alright, keep going. Let's nab this. It's probably some sort of seat of magic. No, it's a seat of running. Yeah, that's correct. There is a magic seat here, but it's a little bit later. If I get to a certain point in the game and I have access to a certain ability for Fina, I may need to give her some MP seeds because she has an unusually low amount of MP. But we'll probably be fine. Now eh, we're close to the boss. I'll leave this in. So we got a resurrection potion coming up and just a couple of money drops. 
I really do want to get... Uh, my leveling goals reached before the boss, the which is very doable. Cast a couple of tremors in this battle, and that ought to do the trick. Might need three tremors, but I'm going to get them off here, so I might as well. Uh, let's have you attack the guy that's furthest away. Hear the earth roar! And one more tremor if I get another turn. Uh, isn't it nice to just be able to slaughter them? They're weak to earth, so tremor's very good against them in general. Oh, they leveled up the earth spell. Okay, cool. <laughs> Pretty easy. Yeah, tremor's good. Not as good as Quake, but, you know, I'll take it. Take what I can get. Quake is somewhat expensive, but gets the job done. Alright, now that I've finished that off, I'm just going to go ahead and go to town on the enemies now. Grab that. Should be our resurrection potion that I don't know if we can actually obtain. Oh, I guess we can. Okay. Yeah, we jump across the same pond now. Just gonna leave the fights in now. I'm gonna go through them pretty quickly. Get the money here. In fact, I think we're basically. I think this is the last one. Till the boss, so. Yeah, the boss is like halfway through this area, although. Well, three fourths, I guess. It is a long area, but I'm just kind of slaughtering everything, so. Should we use Random Hurl? Yeah, sure. It's a good opportunity for it. Maybe a Shockwave? I don't have the SP for it. Well, now we can actually go ahead and do things for the sake of doing them because they're effective. Hit those moss with fire because they're weak to it. I think the land slugs will take more damage from it too, because they're weak to explosion, so that's part fire. What a cinch. I got another swallowtail hat. Awesome. I'll give that to the next character. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright, let's keep going. No mana egg here, but oh well. We'll get mana eggs eventually. Oh crap. Get rid of that health weed. I'm going to have to actually manual this in here. And discard the antidote. Oh, really? There's another enemy? Well, whatever. If you seek death, so be it. Ah, damn it. They're in a crappy love. Formation here. Well, they're getting burn flared, I'll tell you that right now. I'd use Hal NATO if they were weak to wind, but I don't think they are. No. Oh, that didn't do it. Here, allow me to fix that for you. Uh, I actually got weapon experience there, too. Awesome. Ah, random hurl's so good for leveling up daggers. What a cinch. The reason why I don't care too much about daggers is because... They're not great. <laughs> they, uh... To level, they only give you agility. Agility's probably the worst stat in the game. It just affects your running speed. Not your actual turn order. Uh, wit would be what affects your actual turn order. Your IP gauge there. Alright, just head to the right now. Yeah, it's a little kid. What's a kid doing? Password? Password? 
Huh? Whoa! Well, that was weird. Tower rats? What do you mean, tower rats? Well, whatever. Before we go any further, I actually want to go ahead and preemptively equip for the boss. Just because. Before I forget. I want to equip the hatchet because why not? It's, uh, the boss is a plant. Equip the tree amulet. Yeah, so I can use more skills. And Fina, I want to go ahead and equip the burning hot whip because I believe the boss is weak to fire. Yeah, that's basically it, which doesn't take very long. Stay with the demon eye stone. I could give her the chain of gems, but I'm probably going to have her cast magic anyway. I might use fire whip, actually. Yeah, I probably will use fire whip. Alright, yeah, let's just head over here. Yeah, the boss is weak to fire. Well, here we are. Who dares destroy this forest? I hear a voice from somewhere. This forest belongs to the people of Kafu. If you value your life, leave it once. Hey, hey, hey! I don't know who you are, but how dare you threaten me? Really, Justin? If you have something to say, stop hiding and come out here. Really? Coward? Who's calling me a coward? Now you're in for it. What? How were they standing on that without it falling in for so long? Is it like Looney Tunes? See? It's them, Rap. The ones we told you about. All right, Nikki. Good job. You did good. Stupid jerks. Kind of redundant. This. We're just adventurers passing through the forest on our journey. Ha. Huh, I never believe anything oh, from the God Rap. Rod. Huh? What? what did you say? These scum must be with the rats in the tower. Take them to town and hang them. Jeez. You punks. <laughs> Who the heck are you? I forgot he said that to her. I'm Rap of Kafu. Yeah. I guess someone needs to teach you a lesson. He doesn't make a good first impression. So what? You want to fight? Let's kick his ass. Hey, Nikki, you guys go back to town and tell the youngins. Right. Okay, Rap, we're going. Bye. You play dirty. Can't handle me one on one, huh? <laughs> you trying to act tough, fool? Don't you worry your little head. Insolent the fool. Back here, you'll be history. Don't count on it. Why are they still just standing out there? Yes, Rap! Help me! Nikki, what's the matter? Ah, uh, you guys sure are lucky. I'll let you stay alive a little longer. <laughs> the way he read that line is so hilarious. Ah, uh, you guys sure are lucky. I'll let you stay alive a little longer. <laughs> this is the last hint messages, by the way. There's uh, three gold things around here somewhere. There's one. I forget exactly where they are. Uh oh. I almost just walked into that. Uh, game? Where's the other two? There's two. Whoa, that was weird. That's one of those glitchy things. And there's three. Okay. So, should I save? Probably, although... I don't think it matters that much. But I guess I'll save. Unfortunately, we don't get to equip, uh... Well, you'll see. Oh, I wanted the hatchet here, because this guy has, uh, immunity to physical attacks. Or at least, damn close to it without the hatchet. Oh, we have Zap Whip, too. So we can actually use that. Oh, no! It's a giant tree monster! Uh, not really. We barely even know who you are. So this is the Trent. 
It's weak to fire, wind, and lightning, resistant to freeze and explosion, immune to water, earth, and forest. The arm part is weak to fire, wind, and lightning, resistant to freeze and explosion, immune to water, earth, and forest. And the flower part is weak to fire, wind, and lightning, resistant to water and explosion, and immune to earth and forest. So, basically, he can put you to sleep. And that's about all he can do that's remotely interesting. All the rest of his attacks are pretty generic, standard attacks. They're like AoEs, not anything to worry about. Let's see, Rap, I guess I'd use Missile with him. He's not great. He only starts with Fire Magic. Yeah, he's kind of crappy. Uh, Mistide is pretty useless. Just teleport you, I wouldn't use it. This is an AoE. Uh, I would use it normally, but I don't have a tree amulet, so oh well. Side throw hits everybody, but eh. Rap really isn't strong enough for me to make use of him, actually, so I wouldn't use anything but missile on the main body. Why not? You're not gonna get away from this. It's not great. Ah. Yeah, Rap is our replacement for Sue. He is indeed permanent, but yeah, it doesn't matter that much. So we got Lotus Cut, which we can use. So he's weak to fire, and we have an axe that deals more damage versus trees, so... Let's just go ahead and, uh... Should we hit the... Should we go for the flower or the tra... Nah, let's just go for the main body because I don't think it matters. I'm gonna use Zap Whip because why not? I have it. If you don't have it, don't worry about it. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Uh, I'll use Dragon... Uh, Dragon Zap. as her main damage. Awesome. So I could basically kill him now. Oh, oh Flower Beam. Yeah, it's a line AoE. Nothing to worry about. Oh, yeah, that does some damage. Stronger than I remember it being. But then again, Rap has terrible stats right now. So that's probably why it did so much to him. Dragon Zap's the way to go. You could use Dragon Cut if you want. But uh, I'd rather use Lotus Cut. It's a little more efficient. I'm just going to go ahead and finish out the main body. I mean, you can get some more experience and gold. Well. That's a lot of gold. I should probably take out the arm and the flower. Oh, lightning. Strike down the enemy. Yeah, I should take out the other parts because it, it's 4,000 gold if I take them out. I don't think you get it if I only take out the main part. Oh no, we can- Oh, you do get it. Okay. Well, there you go. You learn something new every day. Yeah, just Lotus cut the main part then. I probably tested that and forgot to write it down, but... Either way, yeah, Lotus cut the way to go. I forgot I used Lotus cut more than I used Ice cut. Which is funny, because I changed my strategy to get Ice, ice cut... Or my tactics, uh, my leveling tactics to get Ice Cut to use for the dragon. Yet I use Lotus Cut more. That's funny. Yeah, he's an easy boss. Thanks, Rap. Yeah, sorry about that. I, that's alright. Apology accepted. Even though you're a pretty boring character, Rap. Yeah, he doesn't quite have the same energy that Sue brought to the party, but, eh. What can you do, right? Yeah, what about these towers? Yeah, I don't know why he's got a picking nose thing going on there. Kind of strange. So, let's take a look at Rap. Oh, I think we won a Leaf Shield, by the way. I want to go ahead and equip that... Oh, no. We didn't win a life shield. We're gonna find a leaf shield here, huh? Yeah, it's the last thing we're gonna get. Okay. I thought he dropped it, but I was incorrect. Uh, let's take a look at Rap. Yeah, he only starts with fire magic, so... He's got, uh, daggers 12, swords 9, bows 23. He cannot use actual bows. The icon lies to you. He can only use uh, shurikens or throwing weapons. 
fire, he's only starts at level 5, 4, whatever. As you can see, he only needs 24 knives, 25 swords. He already... He, and he needs 32 bows. <laughs> well, first things first. Let's equip... Let's change his equipment here. Well, for one... We'll go ahead and give him a swallowtail hat because we won one already. Give him a air sneaker because we can. He actually starts with a black belt, which ups your move power level. It is very, very good. It's going to be a primary uh, accessory for us for boss battles. And let's go ahead and use the bow book on wrap, which will give him from 78 strength up to a more respectable 108. That is the primary reason why I give him Sue's uh, book. Not only does it prevent me from ever having to work on his throwing weapons ever again, because he gets 32 plus, but it gives him enough strength to where he can compete with Justin. Otherwise, he's behind even Fina, and that is just sad. So, don't bother using that. Just go ahead and work on something else. I don't know. I'm going to give him the Dragon Killer for now. Yeah, his swords are the lowest, so... There you go. Do I have a setup for him? I don't think I do. No. I didn't think so. Anything of note about rap? Yeah, that's it. So, just do that. I'm not going to list him in the video description. I mean, just... I don't want to spoil the fact that he joins, and... We're nearly done with this area anyway. And all I really did was give him the air sneakers. Just head over to the right here. And, yeah. Are these those new enemies? Are these the pupas? Huge pupa? Yes, they're pallet swaps in the same area. Uh, does that piss anybody else off? Like, at least pallet swap, or irritate anybody. Uh, at least pallet swap in separate areas. Don't pallet swap within the same area. Yeah, they have nasty gas. It can confuse you. But... They're just a little bit stronger version of the uh, land slug. Actually, no, they're weaker than the land slug, uh, strength-wise, but they have more HP. And they're a little slower too than the land slug, or no, a little faster. Yeah. Uh, we could use dragon cut, but I'm not gonna use it here. Let's see. They're weak. They don't have any resistances or weaknesses, so just take them out. As far as Rap's leveling development here, I don't care about anything. I'm just gonna kinda... Oh, crap. I meant to change his, her equipment back. In fact, I still have the hatchet equipped, don't I? How much defense does that Trent have? Fifty-eight. Even though I think he has like an additional creature type resistance thing going on. If you don't have the hatchet for him, it's not a big deal. I think Lotus Cut bypasses it as well. But, but eh, it's there. Back to the Azure Knife because we can. I might even get to level 17 fire, but I'm not overly concerned about it. Maybe if I could get swords up to 10 for him, I'd be okay with that, but... Nothing... Nothing substantial there. Yeah, I'll fight another one of these guys. Should be a golden potion coming up. 
Really, I care more about rap for the uh, inventory space. His MP sucks right now, but whatever. We'll get there. I might give him a chain of gems later, but... Oh, did I not change his accessory? Yeah, I must have forgotten to give him back the chain of gems. I was wondering why Justin wasn't attacking three times. I could give that to Rap. It's not a horrible idea. But we're pretty close to the end of this part. Or the end of this area. We're 30 minutes in, but I want to get through this area. There we go, chain of gems. Should be a golden potion that I want to store for later. Since it restores a decent amount of SP to everybody. Too valuable to use, normally, but useful for the final battles. I will be using it eventually, or at least some of it. Okay, we got a few battles here. Three of them, it looks like. Eh, four. Okay, I took them out. Uh, I guess those huge pupas can uh, inflict plague on you as well, in addition to confusion. I guess uh, dizzy gas is confusion and nasty gas is plague. You guys want to die that badly? Alright. Got uh, some money down here. Since I have an opportunity to work on... Burn Flame for... Wrap, I'm gonna use it, although... I don't care too much. Wrap is uh, not exactly a magic user. Pretty much your other physical fighter. He will eventually become more powerful than Sue, damage-wise, but he's never gonna match her as far as her tankishness, unfortunately. He doesn't really have any amazing way to level up stuff, although he does have a good way to level up Earth. I believe he gets defense loss. But he doesn't have, like, a fight equivalent or anything like that, unfortunately. But, he's basically going to be the primary focus of our leveling on this too. Because we're pretty close to being done with Justin as well. Should be some money down here. Just a matter of where. Unless I already got it, I'm confusing myself. Can I use another... Burn flame? Yeah, I guess so. Maybe I should use Dragon Cut, actually. Hundred million degrees. Take that. I don't think it's a hundred million degrees, but whatever helps you sleep at night, Rap. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, let's use uh, Dragon Cut. Gadwin's secret move. I mean, look at the SP I'm gaining just from leveling these weapons with Dragon Cut. I'm actually quite far ahead with Justin now, which is not unusual because of Dragon Cut, but it's a little earlier than I thought it would happen. But I'll take it. You know, better to be ahead than behind if you're not quite up to my stuff. Well, you're not quite up to my weapon levels for Justin. That's fine. Let's see here. Is it down here? Uh. Oh, I must have already gotten it. It was some money around here, I think. Yeah. It was just some money. I definitely got it because it was right there. Now we gotta head up to the right. I think we gotta go around this. Oh, there's money there. Yeah, I know what that is. Uh, that's the exit, but we don't want to go there yet. 
We want to go below this so that we can get a shield for Fina. There it is. This is the leaf shield I was thinking about earlier. Has some poison resistance, but I don't care about that. I just care about the raw defense. It's really good. Pass down the mushroom shield. No, we're not. I'm going to pass the mushroom shield down. I thought we were. Oh, no, we did. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, give the mushroom shield over to Justin. Or, actually, I think I had the mushroom shield on Justin by default. Maybe I didn't. I think maybe I had the escargot. I don't know. I don't remember what I just did. I'm talking and I'm not paying attention, but whatever. Mushroom shield should be on Justin. And give that leaf shield to Fina. At this point, so. There you go. Go back to where that money was. If I did have the shield on Justin, I shouldn't have, but whatever. Doesn't really matter. It's a mild, minor defensive thing. It will be listed correctly in the video description. I probably did have it right. I'm just not paying attention. Close enough. We're almost done here. So we need 90 SP in order to use two dragon cuts by default, but... Oh, there we go. Nice, good random hurl. Yeah, as you can see, I'm just blasting through the battles now. Simple enough. Some money over here. Yep, there it is. Get the money over here that's straight west of that. There it is. Now the only thing left is apparently an enemy. Now, there's a Seat of Magic over on the northwest here, but there's also in another enemy that is a pain in the ass to fight. But, they are excellent for leveling up, and I am not going to take advantage of them, but I will show off one battle with them, if I can. They also drop Chameleon Armor, which is very, very good. Uh, the enemy in question is called, well, a chameleon. They're resistant to all elements. They have 100 defense, which is pretty good. 100 vitality. What a cinch. Over 200 HP. Uh, they're pretty fast. They have 100 wit, so. But they drop 600 gold. But more importantly, they give a ton of experience for weapons and magic. But they run away when they're spotted. So you gotta be pretty fast to get them. Let's see if I can do this. There it is. Got him. You want to kind of sneak up so you can see him on the TV screen and then go after him. Like I did there. You want to use physical attacks on them. Uh, hopefully you're strong enough to where you can do that. Oh, by the way, without using a throwing weapon, you can't use missile or side throw, but pff, who cares? You still got this cutter. This cutter's a line AoE. I'll eventually be able to use throwing weapons because I'll be able to. I'll be done with his other weapon types, but. Not a terrible idea to use random roll here. I wouldn't use dragon cut because they're resistant to it all. Oh, not bad. As for their attacks. Did I write anything about him? No, not really. I got tail attack. I think that's just an AoE melee attack. Yeah, it's hard to break through him, but you can do it if you're as strong as me. They're kind of like... Super enemies, I guess? Oh, Fina can't even break through him. I guess that makes sense. She doesn't have 100 uh, attack power. Which is why Fina needs to use a skill. 
So yeah, don't be afraid to use all of your abilities. I guess they can defend as well. Here goes. The multiplier should break through. Oh, barely. Huh. There we go. All right, we won. You can also train magic against them. Like, magic works. I guess you could use Dragon Cut. Yeah, because it will damage them, but I don't think it would kill them because they're resistant to the element. See, the other one ran away there. But you pretty much got to use skills to deal with them. But you could use uh, magic for, you know, leveling purposes. Didn't see that coming. At all. That's the last item, by the way. Uh, I could fight the rest of the enemies here, but I think we're just gonna go through. Because, frankly, we're pretty well off here. Yeah, Rap would be extremely weak without leveling Sue like I did, which is another reason why I spent so much time leveling Sue. Uh, using the fight ability because Rap just needs the help early on. He is horrible when he joins on disc two. All right, we won. Even if you haven't been going out of your way like like I have been to drag battles out, Justin would still be way ahead of him. But Rap will catch up eventually. Um. Yeah, I think I've had enough of these pupas. Let's just get out of here. That's enough game. I've, I've had enough. I'm ahead of my leveling goals. We're fine. We can get out of here. Might as well attack with Rap. Get some experience. I might fight those uh, butterflies, though. Because they give good experience. And there's four of them. Because I can get a uh, burn flame off and get another fire level for Justin. Yeah, once the chameleons disappear like that, huge pupas come out and it's annoying. So I don't recommend using those guys to level grind, but you can if you want. Huh, I thought I had, uh, oh no, one lower. There's a cousin of theirs that's good for uh, farming money, I think. Or regular experience, I think. Yeah, I think they give regular experience. I think they're called alligators. I forget exactly, but... Alright, I can drag this out because... I have swallowtail hats. Well, I'm not really going to drag it out. I'm just going to use a dragon cut because I actually can. I was gonna use Burn Flare, but why bother? I have Dragon Cut. Gatwin, secret move. Dragon Might as well get Earth fight. Experience too. Get used to this animation because we're gonna be doing it an awful lot. All right, we won. Yeah, Justin's very quickly gonna level everything up. Look at that experience. Dragon Cut is almost as good as Fight. Not quite, because Dragon Cut costs a lot more, but... And you don't use it on your party, but... It's still pretty damn good. Ow! There we go, there's the exit. So, going to Cafu now. Head on in. Oh, we can buy Swallowtail hats, which is why I wouldn't have gone out of my way to get them, by the way. But here we are. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, we could do that, or we could, uh... Should we buy things? Eh, let's go to the end. 
I don't think he can actually rest up right now. I really hope he can save. Yeah, we can save. Good. Alright. Um, we'll do the shopping and everything tomorrow. Or on the next episode. There's some good stuff we can get. Nah, I kind of want to do it now. But I want to save. In case I screw up shopping. Okay. Yeah, let's shop. want to kind of spread out my items here. I'm going to store all that stuff, but, you know. So. Let's go ahead and go to the armor shop. If you need a swallowtail hat, I would get one for Justin and Rap. But I don't need to because I got them as drops. Now, wing boots. You see how it says it's 7 defense and 35 movement? Now, that 35 movement is less than the 48 that the air sneakers give you. So, initially on my first test run, I didn't buy it. The description is lying to you. This is a mistranslation or a mistake. It is not 35 movement. It is 50 movement, which makes these boots... One of the best boots in the game. We are finally going to replace those air sneakers. So... I'm not going to trade away the air sneakers because I can't get them again. And they're very, very good. But I'm going to equip them on Justin. On Fina. And on Rap. They are excellent. I also want to go ahead and get this uh, LA shield. I think that's a Lafa shield. It is really, 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 really good for Fina. I'm not going to trade that leaf shield because I think I'm going to pass that down. It ups her magic. It makes her stronger. Overall, it's a very good shield. I think I'm leaving it on her for almost the rest of the game. So, yeah, it's very good. Also, oops. Buy a fourth wing boots for later. Unfortunately, it won't be quite as useful as I would like, but I still want one to, to store for later. None of this other stuff, I think, is worthwhile. I mean, it's better, but I don't really like it. Eh, the warp one damage is interesting, but I think it's just too expensive for what you get out of it. I want to buy a shaker knife for uh, wrap. It can paralyze, and it deals decent damage. I would not buy the Shaker Sword because... Or the Shah Sword. I think it's a Shadow Sword. Because... In killing an enemy instantly will cripple your experience gain, so don't do that. Buy that. Oh, crap. There's got to be something I can get rid of, right? Yeah, the uh, vaccine there. Good. What's that honey do? Just restores HP. I'm never going to use it. Okay, seriously. Shaker knife. For wrap. Best knife for a while, so pick that up. You could get that to unblock magic in combat, but... Why? Just bring a couple of Panaceas with you. It's worth it's worth considering, but I don't, I think it's too much money. Uh, catfish whip. It's a water whip. It's very powerful, but I'm basically done with whips anyway, so I'm not going to bother with it. If you want to, I guess you could get it, but... I just don't think it's worth for the price tag. And I really do need to save money for the next town. You think this stuff is expensive? <laughs> yeah, things are going to skyrocket in price. So, based on the way I'm budgeting, I just don't have money for that stuff. 
Are we getting a black belt? No, I don't think so. I think we're going to find a black belt. Anything else? No, I don't think so. Yeah. I mean, that LA shield was really expensive, but it is just so good. I mean, I'd buy the, like I said, to get the two swallowtail hats if you need to, but eh, you shouldn't need to. Since I did get them, I could buy that tree thing, but I don't, it, it will clutter up my inventory anyway. And eventually we're going to have more than one character with Halval anyway. And I don't think I've ever, I've very rarely gotten everybody magic blocked and there's usually a save point around anyway. So let's stash away everything we need, we don't need. I'm going to store the Confusion Shuriken because I like the Angel Darts better. Store that. Store that. Don't need the Air Sneakers anymore. The Seeds don't need. I'm never going to use that. Store that. Never going to use that. I don't need an extra Swallowtail hat. That shield is too weak at this point. Store that. Store the wing boot for later. Actually, I think I'm going to want that out. Yes. I might want to hold on to that. I'll think about it. Doesn't he have a knife I can store? Oh, you can store the flint knife probably because the shaker knife is better. I'll hold on to it in case I want two non-elemental knives. Never gonna use that. Never gonna use that. Not gonna use that anymore. I don't think I'm gonna use the petro... The... Yeah, I'm not gonna use the hatchet anymore. By the time another tree boss shows up, I really won't care at all. Water charm, never gonna use that. I guess that's pretty good. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna keep the wing boots out because it's not too long when I get a character that can use them, so I am gonna keep them out. Just for later. It's not a big deal. And if I want to store anything else, I'll do it off screen. Alright. Gonna save up here. Next time we'll go explore the town. And then go to the next area, probably. Uh, this is Ryzen. Thanks for watching. Take care.